Sorry, closed. Ah, oh. oh. says open. No, it says closed. Well, I just want a pint of milk. That won't take a few seconds. Sorry, done the till, cashed up. Well, okay, give me a pint of milk and I'll come back tomorrow and pay you. Don't give credit. <laughs> Are you telling me you're not going to serve me some, is that it? Try around the corner in Rosman Street. Mm hmm. Thanks very much for your help. Mr. McDonald, and how are you this evening? I'll tell you the truth, we're a wee bit confused, so I must really say. Confused? But confusion, they say, is not very good for the digestion. No, not at all. Tell you the truth, there's a few things I'm finding hard to swallow right enough, one of which is your son refusing to serve me tonight. Vikram refused to serve you? He did indeed. The shop said it was open, but he said he was closed. What time was this? Eight o'clock. We were open until 9, 9.30. Not tonight, you're not, Bugger. Oh, I see. Well, I'll get to the bottom of this. What is it that you wanted? Just a pint of milk. Well, you stay here. I'll personally fetch you a pint of milk. Right, don't worry your head, Robbie. I went across the road to the garage and I got one there. Mind you, that was on your son's advice, so it was. Judy, my darling, I'll be back in a minute. Cheerio, now. Uh -huh. So, I get a lecture from Mr. MacDonald on how I'm not running my business properly. And what do I find when I get down here? He is right. The shop is closed. Not my fault. No. And who keeps telling me that she is in charge of the shop? Being in charge doesn't mean I'm the only one working here. But there was nobody working here last night. Oh, anyway, this gentleman needs serving. Well, oh, cheers. That's for me and Kev down at the garage. I'm on the books there now. Are you really? Yeah, proper job and all. I just wouldn't have all this gear on, would I? Ah, probably not. 2.45, please. Thank Thanks. you. There you go. All uh, right, see you. Bye. Ah, the playboy of Weatherfield, the man about town. Good morning. Good morning, son. And how are you this morning? Yeah, fine, thanks. Why was this shop not open last night? It was. <laughs> no, and I'm witness to the fact that when Mr. McDonald came here looking for milk, it was decidedly not open. Oh, no, it wasn't open all night, no. No. Because it was dead quiet. There were no customers. Oh, yes, it would be. <laughs> because it was not open. Anyway, the point is that you are paid to be here whether there are customers or not. Now, that's just stupid. You see how he is? No, no, no. What I see is that I have invested in these premises and in stock, and now I see my investment sitting here losing money because the two of you cannot organize it between yourselves as to who should be behind the counter. I have organized it. And then I reorganized I it. I don't yeah. want to know. Sort it out between yourselves. All I ask is, please, when I'm out having a peaceful drink, I don't want to be disturbed by people asking me why they can't get milk. <laughs> 